While we know some people like to use a certain hand gesture while driving, BMW allows you to use other hand gestures to get the most out of your ultimate driving experience. Welcome back, I'm Dylan with Beamer Tech. Beamer Tech is pleased to announce our new gesture control retrofit for BMWs with iDrive 7. Now, what is gesture control? Well, we know some of you may have it and some of you may want it, so let's learn a bit more about it. BMW has always had safety in mind, but knows that drivers can get distracted with all this newfangled technology. So they've implemented gesture control, where a swipe of a hand can create so many different outcomes. Just a quick reminder, if you want to learn more about the products we offer and more tips and tricks about BMWs, make sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to ring that bell. This feature is found on most of the latest G-Series BMWs with a 7.0 operating system, MGU iDrive. Here is a list of those vehicles. So how does it work? BMW has a 3D camera that is programmed to recognize predefined hand gestures that will control certain features in your BMW. For these gestures to work most efficiently, you want your hand above the gear shifter and close to and in line with your screen. Here are the gestures you can do in your BMW. Accepting or rejecting a call, confirming or rejecting a pop-up, turning the volume up or down, changing the 360 camera view, skip forward or back, and two configurable gestures. If you have gesture control in your BMW, you can activate it by selecting Car in your iDrive menu, then entering Settings, and go to General Settings. Search for Gesture Control and choose whether you want to activate it or deactivate it. Once you have it activated, here's how to perform the gestures. To accept a call or confirm a pop-up, point one finger at the screen and pull back. To reject a call or close a pop-up, swipe your hand to the right. To turn the volume up, circle your finger clockwise and the opposite to turn it down. To change the 360 view of your vehicle, pinch and drag to the left or right. Point your thumb to the left to skip back and to the right to skip forward. Pointing with your index finger and middle finger or flashing all five fingers twice are two customizable gestures. Customizable gestures can be assigned in the gesture control settings. For a full list of gestures, search possible gestures. If you don't have gesture control on your vehicle, but have one of these vehicles with iDrive 7, then our retrofit will be compatible. We'll have a full installation video on this soon, but it's pretty much as simple as swapping out the dome module and running a couple wires. Keeping focused while driving is extremely important, so using BMW's gesture control is fantastic. We hope you found this video helpful and learned a bit more about gesture control. To find out if our BMW gesture control retrofit kit will fit your vehicle, head on over to our website and enter your VIN, and remember that shipping is always free. For more tips and tricks about BMWs and how Beamer Tech can help you with your ride, make sure you subscribe and don't forget to ring that bell. Thanks for watching.